Hello friends and welcome back to 7 Days to Die Alpha 10.3 with your host Rongo the Bold. I'm looking kind of grizzly this morning, I must say. I uh I like the new hair. So remember if you are modifying your character in order to see it in game, you do need to go in and uh turn the use persistent profile to off when you start your game up. Otherwise, you will not have your changes saved. But uh, he has hair as well, but it looks like any helmet you put on uh, takes hair off. So let's, uh, let's go ahead and take a look and see what he looks like with his helmet completely off. Yep. All right, big boy. This is our guy. He's looking a little shaggy, a little unkempt. But you know what? He's a survivor. He's awesome. That is what Rongo looks like through the waving grass. Okay, so last night I went ahead and made a bunch of TNT, like 43 TNT. Um, so we're in really good shape for that. Uh, I forgot to bring a gun over, so I'm gonna run back, run back over to our other to our other little base, and we're gonna grab a gun. And then what we're really in, hello, folks. How you guys doing? One for you, and one for you, and oh, we don't forget you. All right, thanks, gentlemen. Oh, and Lurch coming in. Oh, nice shot. Oh, one more. Uh, sorry, that, that, that last episode I kind of goofed out. Uh, didn't realize that I turned the mic off when I went to sneeze. And uh, never quite put it back on. So, lesson learned. Need to grab it all the animal fat now because uh, candles. We're going to make some candles. So, candles are tallow, which is melted down fat, and um, plant fiber. And with those two, you can make some great candles, which are quite nice. They uh, have a nice little holder. They look really, they're kind of pretty. I like them. So, we'll, we'll get that. Um, Torches now despawn after after around 20 minutes. It's kind of a randomized time. Uh, they are brighter than they used to be. So you're not going to use them as your main source of illumination anymore. So we will be putting lots of candles up in the house. So I'm looking forward to that. Trees are looking like they're about ready to be plucked. Uh, let's see. What did I come over here for? Let's put this towel fat away. Um, came over for a gun. So... I know we've got a pistol around here somewhere. Some rounds. And perfect. Okay, um, we could also use some food. So let me make up a, a quick batch of some delicious ham and eggs for breakfast. Ham and eggs, it's what's for breakfast. There we go. Ah, Whew, just in time. All right, and while that's going, uh, let's see what else we got to do. Oh, I wanted to show you guys beer. So let's go ahead and drink some beer just to see what the effect is. Glarg. So you can also now get drunk off of uh, grain alcohol as well. So the buzz effect. Okay, just two every second. Beer buzz. There's no duration limiter. Uh, when I did test it in the my test game, uh, it lasted for a while. Um, I didn't actually notice when it finally debuffed itself, but uh, it did finally debuff. It just took a while. Might have been like 20 minutes, so we'll see. So anyway, it's a stamina gain. So it's like coffee, only possibly better. So let's kind of keep an eye. Uh, about four minutes into the video, and we'll kind of keep an eye and see when that actually ends. Maybe you guys can help keep an eye as well. And let me know when I get there. So I'll probably forget when it actually drops off. Mmm, bacon eggs. Okay, let's go blow some shit up! Looking forward to this. I love TNT mining. I don't usually do it um, just because it does draw the hordes. Um, and it also, as you do it carefully, you can destroy your what you're after. So we're gonna we're gonna do it carefully. Just place one at a time. Take our time. Do not rush things. Maybe I'll start over here. So I want that iron up there. 
and this clay. So I'm just going to stick one on the wall, back off. You want to do it one at a time, otherwise you will destroy that which you are trying to harvest. Explosions! Oh, my goodness. Oh, look, they're all upset already. Oh, I love it. It does make mining so much easier. But uh, yeah, <laughs> we're gonna have we're gonna have a horde here very shortly, so it's definitely not the stealthy way of uh, living. I hope I'm far enough away. Just gotta keep an eye on our back doors here. Make sure we don't get any surprises. You know, what we're mostly after right now is uh, stone. Really, because um, we've got to make a lot of gravel. Oh, hello! We've got to make a lot of gravel, and we also need a lot of stone for um, the cobblestone that we're going to need for the house. So, I don't want to just get iron, but iron good too. Iron good! Oops. I actually don't think we have enough bullets for all this. Which is a, a sad state to be in. All right, let's. Uh, I do need stones. Let's 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 focus on stone. Put one there. Where's that guy at? Oh, hello. Are you upset with the noise? Is the noise a little much for you, huh? I'm sorry. I wish they would let you do some sort of other way of exploding TNT besides shooting it. Because it is a kind of a waste of bullets. In fact, we, we may have to actually make some... In fact, I should think about that. I'll always make sure I leave one... Let's leave one round in case um, we need to make a mold. Yes, 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 yes. Always thinking. Rongu is always thinking. Usually thinking poorly, but you know, it, even even poor thinking is still thinking. I'm gonna need. Oh, really? I'm gonna need to make a run um, to another forest biome because we need to find um, those red flowers, the chrysanthemums, as well for our floors and cabinets. So that will be a priority here coming up. And I want to go back to that town. Um, I want to get the house sort of up, the walls at least, before we do a major town push, uh, loot push. But I also want, I don't want to have you guys wait too long between you know build lots of building episodes and a nice fun looting episode. Now, if you are if you got debug mode on, you can actually hit uh, F8 twice, and it shows you uh, we are we're at eighty percent heat in this chunk, so we will be getting a horde fairly soon. Hello, folks. How you guys doing? Ah. Okay, you guys need to stop moving so I can kill you. All right, let's get rid of that. So in case you guys want to know how that works, that's, that's, that's how that works. Type DM in your single player game. Uh, you can't do it on multiplayer unless you are set as an administrator in the game world. Hey nurse, what you got for me today? Kind of bring me vitamins or any other goodnesses? All right, let's take a look at what she's got. Great alcohol. All right. Oh, and look down below. The status effect is gone for the beer. Now, do we have a negative static? Do we get the hangover effect? There's no hangover effect, so I wonder if that's that's might be bugged out right now. So, okay. Well, 
we now know that. Okay, let's keep going with our destruction. Stone, stone, stone. How are we doing this, though? We've got... Nice, 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 nice. Gravel's pretty cheap. You get um, you, know, you get a lot of gravel for each piece of stone. And you also get uh, two cobblestone rocks per uh, piece of stone. We're going to need a lot more. This is, this is way efficient. Hope you guys are liking this. Let's look at that. Uh... Oh, the heat dropped. Oh, I made a different chunk. I was in chunk 7214 before, and now I'm in 7212. Huh. Interesting. Now, there's also another trick you can do. Um, I haven't been doing it because I'm, I'm lazy. But if you are TNT mining, it is a good idea to go in and uh, dig a hole for your TNT to be placed into. And what this does, is it allows you to have the front part of the blast as well. Because basically right now I'm just getting... You know, all the sides other than the front areas. So let's go ahead and place this back in here a little bit farther. All right. There you go. Yeah, we have it more. We have it more rock. All right. Wow, this is really coming together nicely. Liking it. All right, let's go another little spot back in here. <coughs> Got to hurry up and finish this episode. I have a uh, ritual. This is uh, I'm recording this on Saturday morning, and I've got a, a ritual of Thai food Saturday. I've got to make sure I make my Thai food Saturday day. Love me some Thai food. Oh, we're kind of. Yeah, I'll just take it here. Take what we get, right? Wow, look at this place. Oh, those sp spiders are unhappy with me. I have 16 rounds left and 21 more. Where are they? Look at this place. Wow. I've done a number on this hill. What if we should go up for him? Yeah, let's do this. I want that clay too, because we're gonna need to make we're gonna need to get clay. Oh, you guys upset with me, huh? Somehow still undetected. Somehow. All right, let's dig a little spot into here. This is again, we need we need rock. Just like three, three back, I guess would be good. And then this, I think, will be a good start for the day. Um, we gotta turn it into cement. We'll finish up our wall, and then we will begin our build. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. We are doing amazing. Crops are growing. It's beautiful. That's going. Okay, so the next item on our list is to start building this frame out. Um, I'm going to do... So this is ground floor. So all of the interior will be will be redwood plank. Um, so we're going to have this. Then we're going to have three inside high. So that's four on the outside then the next floor, so five, and then probably th another three, so eight, um, eight blocks high. So it's going to be fairly high. So let's go ahead. Uh, we'll take this corner, 
Take the corners out just so we can we'll replace those with our uh, frames for cobblestone. So we know exactly what we're doing. And <clears throat> condense this stuff down. Uh, we need cobblestone rock. That'll be our next thing. So sticks. Knots and lots of sticks. We have... Oh, I need my plant fibers, which I've kept in the other jar, of course, because I'm a moron. Oh. You know, sometimes the, the wrong one doesn't plan as far ahead as he thinks he's going to. Let's just gather a little bit of grass. We've got one, two, three, four, six, or five, five corners that we need to build to start off with. So, cobblestone frame is sticks and plant fiber. So that's our frame. Now, these frames are very light, so um, they have very poor structural integrity. So if you're doing an arched, like an, over a doorway, or if you are doing um, uh, a ledge, you need to be sure to support the frame. And we'll show it, I'll, when, I, when I get to the point of actually building um, one of our doorways, I'll, let you, I'll show you guys. But basically these are really weak, so they will break, um, if they try and go, if you go out, go, go out by two, like up and then over one and go out second one, they'll fall off. Um, and if you put any weight in them, one out, they'll fall off. So you need to support them really well when you're building them. So let's go ahead and just build this up. So now we got our corners placed. There we go. Okay, so our corners are placed, so now we can go ahead and pick up all the other frames. Okay, now I can't show you yet. So look at this kind of cool little detail, a little, little plant fiber rope. Sticks in the corner. Yeah, I like it. Once again, pimps, good job. Good, jolly good job. I'm going to have to definitely put some uh, undo in the back here because I'm going back and forth all the time to our little hut. Oh, there's our, there's the down. So I can grab that cement mix, which should be ready. Oh, snipe these guys nope not yet come on oh nice hit that was a that was gorgeous if I do say so myself wow look how, look how quickly we just destroyed that hill All right, so let's see what we got for concrete. So we can remake our broken, all these plant fibers, all of that I need. I'll grab those sticks right here. Okay, um, got 55, it's 100. Um, let's put, uh, yeah, let's put the, uh, that much. Very, very scientific. Don't question me. It's exactly that much. <laughs> okay. And let's head back. Hey guys, what's up? How you doing? Let's get this on here. If I can get enough done to on day 17, then on day 18, um, I want to run back to that little tomorrow basically you run back to that little town and loot that place up I want to show you guys the bookstore um, luckily I've got my recipes tweaked so that I can actually harvest all the books that, that are in there and turn them into regular books which makes me happy because I'll have shotgun shells and TNT for days okay so now we got that done so the next the next phase is to make cobblestone rock so cobblestone rock is 
you basically drop it like that and you get twice as much as you have in stones. So there's 70 of them. They stack to 250, which is which is quite nice. So we are going to need a lot more stones still. Oop. Okay, it's there and it's a long way away. So let's go ahead on our map. It's a long way away on that path. I'm going to put it here. Uh, maybe a little bit. There we go. That looks pretty good to you guys. All right, so we'll think about that later on. All right, so let's go ahead and start placing these in. I want to check. So I don't need them in your hot. You don't need them in your hot bar. I don't think. Actually, you do. So each block requires four. So we're going to need a lot of stone. Ah, everything about this build is, is lots. So this is going to be a wee bit boring. So I'm going to go ahead. Um, I'll place all of it I can. I'll go get some more, more cement off the, off the forge. And uh, I'll be back when I have all that done. Well, we got a little horde action going. So I thought I would bring it back into game mode for you guys. The zombies seem to be coming out of the woodwork. Um, I think they were uh, finally, they finally heard the echoes of the TNT. How many, okay, I got, I got plenty of, it's a lot of, it's a lot of zombies, folks. Okay, nothing behind me. Nothing behind me. Okay. Let's just start, let's just start killing. Let's start the slaughter. It's hammer time. Of course, I kind of need a sledgehammer. Check behind me. We don't want to be snuck up a papon. You guys are so er eager to be killed. Oh, really? Good. Good. Hello, young lady. How are you? All right, let's go ahead and do a little bit of... Oh, hello. Do a little bit of looting. Yeah, I've got these nails. So I expect to have a nail gun soon. Even though the nail gun as a weapon is not... Um, exactly great oh look at them all I'm going to sit back here and just take some pot shots this is where that sniper rifle would come in really handy alright Here, lurch here. Most of them don't seem to know where I am. We got a few that do, but not all of them. Okay, it's more coming out of the hills on the left hand side there. Top screen. I do want to loot the nurses because nurses always have. Oh, hell yeah. I'd take that for a dollar. You and love for you. How many have we got coming here? I haven't looked behind me in a while and my back is starting to itch. Okay, good. Nope, they're all still in front of me. They did tweak the way zombies spawn. Um, they don't drop in anymore, supposedly. Um, so that'll be interesting to see. Why do I have two fasters here? 
I guess the fast ones would get here first, I suppose. Alright, what you got? You got your doorknob. Precious doorknobs. Yeah, fine. Alright. Um. Brass is, is so rare in the game, other than these, that I just need to always grab it. Still quite a few of them. You guys are interrupting my building. And I don't see a single hard hat. This is the construction site, folks. You need to have your hard hats. If you had your hard hat, that probably wouldn't have... Killed you. Come on. There we go. Those lurchers are just hard to hit. They move fast and they just. That constant head bobbing. Gotta time it just right. Okay, I mean, I had just about like 240 bolts, I think. And we have not missed many. I mean, there's a few that taken double shots, but we're down 90 bolts so far, I think, we fired. I thought I heard you sneaking down on me. Come on. Come on, big boy. There you go. So I think we've killed at least 60 or 70 zombies so far. Alright, I'm going club. Club time! Yeah, I got a hit with the club. Make it effective. All that and and a book is all I get for my trouble. Look at this hill over there. There's still ah ah ah. Ah! Couldn't get off the get off of the freaking thing! Oh my god! I can't believe it! I'm getting killed! Oh my god! Oh, that was stupid! I got killed because I hit the wrong button! And... Oh, it makes me so angry! Oh, that was irritating! Oh, I can't believe that! Complete new fail! This new keyboard, I'm ah. Oh. Uh, I would appreciate it if you guys would just laugh at me right now. That was so rookie, so dumb. I oh my goodness. This, oh, embarrassing. I'm embarrassed by my inability to stuff and thing. Come on. I'll lead you guys over here. Get back to my bag. Come on. I can't believe that. That was so stupid. I just, I, I just kept trying to hit escape to clear out of it, and all I kept doing was hitting the the uh, uh, tilde again. Kept bringing up the. Okay, get back over here. I think I lost some stuff. I'm not positive, but I think I did. Get cl clothes on really quick. Okay. Uh, do I have a weapon yet? Let's take a look. There's still so many of them. Holy crap. 
I uh, do not see any... Oh, I got a pistol, but it doesn't count. Hello. Alright, you guys stay over there. I'm going to run back over here. Grab another... Jeez, look at them all. Okay. Got all that stuff. Let's put the clothes on. A little more distance. Oh, how many of them are there? Okay. I don't think so, buddy. All right. Now I'm now I'm angry. And stupid. Angry and stupid. Angry and stupid. Angry and stupid. Okay. Angry and stupid is not good. Okay. Let's not... Let's not go clubbing just because we can. Freaking massive horde. All right. Jeez, I thought I was going to die again because I'm an idiot. I'm keeping the nurses for last. Run back over this way. Hello, you little ankle biters. Let's see what she's got for us. In a very inappropriate uh, position there. Inappropriate! Now we're back on track. All right. The dogs, um, their combat animations also been fixed. Uh, they supposedly now no longer do their spinning attack. So that should make them a little easier to kill. So we will see next time we go to the hub city how they behave. Now the one thing about our current uh, playthrough is we will not have a, a hub city decked out because um, it's already been generated for us. So we're not going to get the new buildings in the hub city until we... Um, until we get um, a new map. So just keep that in mind that the hub city now for us is a little a little pranged. But if we can find another wasteland city, then there's a good chance that we'll find new stuffs in there as well. Okay, I'm still hunted. By who? You? No? Oh. Ah, get a nurse in here. She appears to be a little lost. Hey, honey. How you doing? Ah, I love my little TNT mine. Huh. Still hunted by... Oh, there we go. Now, we have noticed on the... on. Bearded Bob uh, on our Twitch stream on Friday uh, Friday nights at uh, 8, p 8 p.m. UK time, so GMT zero. Um, we found that uh, we've got a huge uh, hole down in the ground in a, in a little bay of a lake, 
and um, the zombies stop animating their fall halfway down. They don't fall all the way. That's kind of funny. Okay, so we were coming over here to get more gravel. So I will see you guys in a little bit. Um, this has been Rung of the Bold. I hope you enjoyed this episode. A little change out a little different than I thought it was going to. But a little excitement is always enjoyable. So I will talk to you guys in the next episode. Uh, we'll be doing more concrete work, more cobblestone work, a little bit more of everything. Ah. So if you like that one, click that like button, comment, tell me what you think, and I will see you guys later.